Singapore has not made any decision to deploy nuclear energy yet but must keep its options open and build expertise in the area, Minister for Trade and Industry Gan Kim Yong said on 23 October 2023 during the Singapore International Energy Week. Mr. Gan said on the first day of the annual event that Singapore was exploring low-carbon energy sources, including hydrogen and nuclear energy. The use of nuclear energy was one of three possible scenarios previously set out by Singapore in its Energy 2050 Committee report released last year. The report identified nuclear energy as a potential power source to achieve net zero emissions by 2050, with this form of energy potentially able to supply about 10% of the country's needs. However, Mr. Gan stressed that Singapore had yet to make a decision about nuclear energy. Instead, Singapore has been growing its capabilities in nuclear safety, emergency preparedness and response. Singapore conducted a pre-feasibility study on nuclear energy more than 10 years ago which concluded that technologies available then were not suitable for deployment in Singapore, the minister said. But we need to build capabilities to understand advanced nuclear energy technologies that are becoming safer and have the potential to be cost competitive. This way we can study the options seriously when these newer technologies become viable. So why is Singapore exploring use of nuclear energy? The main reason is due to Singapore's national climate target to achieve net zero emissions by 2050 as part of our long-term low emissions development strategy, LEDS. Given that Singapore is an alternative energy disadvantaged island city state, these targets are contingent on technological advances and the economic viability of low carbon technologies, of which nuclear energy is one feasible option. This is the reason why Singapore is exploring the use of nuclear energy. In subsequent videos, Professor Ma will explain more aspects of life. In the meantime, please help by liking and by subscribing. Thank you.